let's make some magic. To start out your look, have your skin prepped and ready to go. Foundation and some powder help create a flawless unicorn base that we're going to need when we apply all of these beautiful colors. So the first product we're going to be applying is the Wildcat palette, and we're going to create some pink brows with this. Grab a brush and dip into the creamy pink shade. This is a beautiful light pink, and apply this to the brows as if you're filling in normally. And voila, you have beautiful pink unicorn brows. Grab in our rainbow glitter palette, pick up the pink glitter, and apply this over the brows. This looks so pretty over top and makes the look more magical. Picking up the cream white shade from the Wildcat palette, I'm going to use this to highlight and prep the eyes for eyeshadow. A white always makes bright colors pop, so this will be perfect for our colorful look. Picking up a shimmery blue eyeshadow, I'm going to blend this into the inner corner of the eyes and out and up for a beautiful pop of blue color. Since we're sticking with unicorn shades, I'm going to pick up a hot pink shadow and apply this to the center of the lid and just blend this all over your entire lid. Lastly, you're going to want to add a purple eyeshadow to the outer corner of your eyes and just blend right out. So now your eyes should look like a rainbow of blue to pink to purple and blend the purple shade out into the temple areas. This doesn't have to be perfect at all because we're going to go back in later and add some stones and also some beautiful decals. Going back into the Wildcat palette, pick up the lavender cream color and start to dab this into the sides of your forehead and down into the cheeks. These are the areas you would normally apply bronzer. Just apply this the same way, except a lot more heavy-handed. The best way to describe it is a C-shape. You always want to make sure you go back in under your jaw and also down your neck with these same shades. Don't be afraid to touch up throughout the look. Here I'm applying the blue eyeshadow to the front of the brow, and then a hot pink shadow to the brows to further intensify them. Using a mixture of the pink and lavender cream colors from the Wildcat palette, I'm going to contour the face by applying this to the cheeks and also blending down the neck. This is just going to amp the look up a lot more. I'm also going to contour the nose with these two shades by just applying a bit to either side and don't forget the tip of your nose for a really cute look. To highlight the nose, grab the white cream color from the Wildcat palette and dab this into the center of the nose. Using the shimmery blue eyeshadow, finish off the lower lash line by smudging this underneath the eyes and down. Dipping into the rainbow glitter palette, grab the blue glitter and start to press this into the cheekbones and also the front of the brows. This glitter is super simple and easy to work with because it already has an adhesive mixed in, so all you need to do is press it right on. If you would like any more details and a coupon for 20% off a single item at Spirit Halloween, check out my description box below. Unicorn face decals are perfect for some fun designs because they stick right on with no adhesive necessary. They work just like a sticker and this set is awesome because you get two for each side of the face. This is great for beginners because there is no drawing necessary. This set also makes an awesome cut crease super easy. You can add some sharpness into the look by using the eye decals and I place them above the crease of my eye for a very glam look and they stick right on. The set also comes with some really fun stars you can stick on as well, and bam, the decals are done. Spirit Halloween has a wide variety of rainbow and press on gemstones, so I use both sets to add fun colors and gems to the face. I place the larger gems towards the forehead area and the smaller ones around the eyes and in front of the eyebrows. Feel free to add on as many as you want because they stick right on, they're super easy, and I also added some of the blue glitter from the rainbow glitter palette underneath the eyes for some glittery unicorn tears. Apply a white eyeliner into the waterline and using the dark blue eyeshadow shade underneath the white liner. This will make the eyes appear a lot larger and a lot more like a unicorn. Next pop on some mascara and you're ready for lashes. The lashes I'm going to be using today are the rhinestone false lashes and I applied them by looking down into my mirror and just placing them onto my lash line. To make them stick on better, I use my thumb and my index finger to press them together for a much tighter fit. This lash set comes with a rhinestone strip so you could actually use this as eyeliner. No adhesive necessary, you can just stick them right on. And since I had two sets of these lashes, I decided to chop up the second pair for the lower lash line and just place them underneath for some bottom lashes. For the lips, add a purple liquid lipstick on for the base and we're going to be using the glitter lip set which comes with a beautiful lip gloss and glitter to top off the lips and I love this glitter so much because it's very frosty and perfect for a sugary unicorn color. Going back into the Wildcat palette, I'm going to use the pink and purple cream shades mixed and I'm going to start dabbing this into the outer chest area and down the arms only. And yes, I was having a lot of fun with this color. 
Using the purple glitter palette, I'm gonna grab the silver glitter and start to dab this into the chest area and all over the neck. And don't be afraid to use the glitter in the lip set to add some more glimmer to the look. I love this so much on the lips and it looks amazing on the body, so I just pressed it all over. Applying the press on gemstones, I'm gonna use silver and purple stones in my chest and neck. For reference, I use a full pack of these gemstones. Inside the unicorn makeup kit are some pearls. I'm gonna apply them next to the larger gemstones. And using the sponge and pink glitter cream color, I'm gonna press this in between the stones for contrast. Lastly, grab the purple glitter palette and use the silver shade and apply this to the nose, chin, and above the lips. For my unicorn costume, I'll be wearing this white corset in size medium, which is super cute. And for the hair, I'll be rocking a wig in the style Lavender Anime Curls. This wig is super easy to pop on and I styled it by just parting it to the side and I pinned the bangs back by my ears. I love this wig so much and here I am saying that it is perfect. Using the purple glitter palette, I'm going to use the dark purple glitter to add some glitter roots into the part of the wig just using my fingertips to apply it. The unicorn makeup kit comes complete with a unicorn horn which was really simple to tuck underneath some of the wig and I further styled the wig by teasing it with a comb to get it really fluffy and big like a unicorn's mane. We have two unicorn horn options, the unicorn headband with ears or the unicorn horn in the unicorn makeup kit which is more simplistic or you could wear both because why not? I'll be wearing the rainbow shredded tutu and white fishnets, a magical clip on sparkly unicorn tail, and to finish off the look, add on these unicorn fur cuffs, they are super fluffy and very very soft. And our unicorn look is complete. I hope you all enjoyed this easy go-to unicorn glitter glam tutorial. Spirit Halloween has the biggest selection of costumes, props, accessories, wigs, makeup, and more to help you achieve the look you want this Halloween. When customers go to Spirit Halloween, they have the option to donate to support Spirit of Children, making their own local hospital less scary for kids. Use hashtag morecowbell and tag Spirit Halloween to share that you donated to help raise awareness. Thank you all so much for watching today. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you in my next tutorial.